Now, I don't know about you, but I don't have money to burn. A handful of money here, and I can't afford to burn it. So, essentially, when I bought Russian bees from Foley's Russian Bees, I essentially wasted my money or destroyed it. <laughs> See, Foley's Russian Bees. This, um, my uh, first order was smaller and I didn't have too much trouble. But my second order was a large 26 queen order. Of those 26 queens, six of them never made it out of the cage. And the reason why is because he puts the workers loose in the box. He doesn't put them in the cage with the queens. And during the summer, when it gets hot, they try to get out and they block the screens on both sides. And what does it say on here? It says air vents do not block. Keep well ventilated. And if you have loose workers in there, they're not well ventilated anymore. And the queens get hotter and it damages their health. And they die days after you put them in the hive. So that's essentially what happened. But let me tell you about the mites. I clean the front of these hives daily and this is just from one day right here. These are Russian. These were started in July with, with the nuke and they didn't grow out of one deep. And I powdered them four times in October with powdered sugar. And here it is November and I really need to do it again because they're full of mites. These, when you see this many bees on the front of your hive on a daily basis, they're dying because of the viruses on the mites or the mites carry those viruses. So don't waste your money with Foley's Russian bees because they are not any better against the mites than uh, Italians are. So thank you.